They don't want to merely fight us. There's something else. If only I could understand why. <laughs> Hydro Genome soldiers, quick, follow me! Yes, sir, Commander! I am ready, Supreme Commander. This is your moment. Go and lead my army to victory. But above all else, remember, I want Hydrostar alive. Consider it already done, my lord. I know how to defeat them. Tell us, Fixion. It may be our only hope. If we use Ultra Omega Rays, we just might be able to destroy their impact strength field. Oh, but how do we know it'll work? We've got to try. I'll give my armies the order to use them. Consider it a surprise attack. Our people have a saying for situations like these. It's not over until it's over. My paratroopers are ready to defend the Ferrum planet. Soldiers, advance. Prepare to attack. No one touch Hydro Star. He is mine. Fixion, why did you wait so long to launch this attack? They're already on top of us. The closer they are, the easier it will be to thwart their plans. Master? Electron? Where are you? Master? Master? Electron? Master? 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 What? What? Is that you, Master? What are you doing up there? This is no time to play hide-and-seek. We're at war! I must reassemble the interstellar map. It's our only chance to discover why these soldiers are here and how we can stop them. This day has been foretold. Prophecies are all well and good, but we've been looking for you everywhere. Silence, Cube. I've managed to reassemble an important area of the map. But now I have to interpret it. And to do this, I need to concentrate. Tell the others I am fine. As you wish and that I must be left alone. Do you need anything? No, thank you. Are you sure? Perhaps a short but sparkling magnetic recharge? I'll be happy to get it. That will not be necessary. Perhaps I can adjust your senses for you. It might help you to relax. Silence! Oh, okay. There's no need to raise your voice. These artificial intelligences. Always so touchy. Hmm. There must be a way to stop this. There must. No matter what they try, they must not pass. We're here to help, Uranium soldiers. The battle is not lost. Aaron, charge up the Ultra Omega Beans, now! Fire! No! Their impact strength fields seem to be impenetrable! Fixion! You mustn't be impatient, Hydrostar. Ultra Omega Beams may take a little while to warm up, but tests have proven their fragmenting effects. Just give us time. Very well. Yes, they've done it, Hydrostar! Their impact strength field has become unstable! Excellent! Ferox, tell your soldiers to ready their parabolic blasters. I'll have my soldiers flank you for support. One moment. Huh? I would advise against rushing things at this stage, Hydrostar. Electron! We can't waste time at a moment like this. The enemy has overrun our planet. We must act now. I believe that we have another option. I have finally learned how we can not only stop our enemies, but defeat them once and for all. What is happening? I want a progress report immediately! Where is my chief? I'm sorry, sir. It would appear that Hydrostar has not been captured yet. He's organizing his armies against us. The planet Hydrogenum is already ours. But it's you I want, Hydrostar. It is imperative that he be brought to these chambers as my prisoner. Bring me Hydrostar. Commander, what are you waiting for? I'm waiting for Hydrostar. He said he was bringing us news about how to defeat this enemy. 
You will be mine, Hydro Star. In the name of Galacticor, you will be mine now. For all atoms. Ah! Hydro Star, are you okay? I'm fine, although it would appear someone is carrying a grudge against me. And I think I know who. How strange. I can almost sense this person's anger towards me. This area is not secure. We must move. Curses! Hydro Star has taken over. I must not fail Galacticor. Mission accomplished, sir. The Ultra Omega Beams have obliterated the enemy's impact strength field. Excellent work, Aaron. Now we must allow Hydro Star to clean up the mess the enemies made. You're our commander. We can't throw you to the wolves. I have no choice. Electron has deciphered a message from the torn fragments of the interstellar map. I must do what it commands. We will place our high-ranking officers inside three positive energy spheres, which in turn will charge our catapult blasters. They're fully charged, sir. Fire! This elite battalion will now cut through the enemy lines. Our soldiers will surround them and finish the job. What? It's not possible. Satellites preserve us. This strategy has proven effective. They may have dominion over dark matter, but we have Electron's genius on our side. Our soldiers are advancing, Electron. It would appear our side finally has the upper hand. They never anticipated this strategy. We have taken them by surprise. And you got this idea from the interstellar map? Return their fire! Glory to Galacticor! Glory to Galacticor! Glory to Galacticor! Commander, some of our soldiers have been taken prisoner. What should we do? I'm well aware of this, Aaron. Thanks to information we learned from Electron, we now know what will happen next. Once quarantined, a transformation takes place inside the cocoon. You mean a kind of metamorphosis? Exactly. Any enemy soldiers we capture will transform into Atomicron allies. So the more enemy soldiers we capture and place in stasis mode, the more our army increases? And the prisoners they have captured then become our enemies. So some of ours will get turned against us? I knew it was too good to be true. We need volunteers to send over. But we can't leave this position. We must hold them off. Keep at it, soldiers. We're winning! Soon they'll surround us. Retreat, but keep firing at them. Yes, yes sir, sir, Commander. Yes, sir, Commander. They're retreating. This must mean we've won. Ah, <sighs> victory, Commander. I am proud of you. We have defeated our opponents. But above all, we have proven that together, we can overcome an evil much mightier than we thought possible. You all did a magnificent job. Commanders, let's hope that this is the first of many victories for the Atomicron Alliance. I would like to invite you to come to our planet to celebrate. Just say when and we'll all be there in our Sunday best. I look forward to it. Hydrostar, the others have arrived. I'll be there shortly. I'm in no mood for celebrations. I understand. You're thinking about your planet, Hydrogenum. Why don't I remember anything? How is it possible that there isn't a trace of what has happened to my planet and my people in my memory banks? Something's not right. I know, but standing out here all alone isn't going to jog your memory any more than attending a party could. Come on. Perhaps you're right, but I will not rest until I have saved my planet. One day, Hydrogenum will occupy its rightful position again. 
Freedom, freedom from the Crumb Alliance, united now and forever! forever. Commander Toxin has kept his word. He said he wouldn't be here, and he is not. Toxin told me that whatever we do is no longer a concern of his. That's an unfortunate development, but the more important question still remains. Exactly who were we just fighting against? Cube is right. We've won, but against who? Can any of us say for certain just who this enemy is? Despite our victory today, there are many questions that still need to be answered. How is it possible that these beings are so similar to us in many ways, and yet so different? Where are they from? And above all, who are they? All you have done, Atomicron Alliance, is postpone what is your destiny. As punishment for making me wait, my vengeance will now be much more cruel and merciless.